Hey, it's Permagamy, and I pulled up this news article after going through several posts talking about the state planning to ram through development plans for Florida state parks. Most of the people that I've heard talk about this are talking about the loss to Floridians of recreational land, but it is much more serious than that. See, Florida is having a real problem with having enough fresh water to meet its needs. One of the things that threatens our fresh water supply is things like golf courses and the pollutants that they dump into the environment. Also, undeveloped land works as a giant filter for water to go into our aquifer and also to try and reduce some of the pollutants that are going into our lakes, rivers, streams, and into the ocean. So compromising these wild lands through development doesn't just take away a recreational resource. It threatens the survival of current residents by allowing more pollution and more degradation of Florida's water resources. This is an incredibly short-sighted development proposal that puts the state itself at risk of losing water resources. It would mean that we would have even bigger and nastier red tide events because they are fueled by the runoff from agriculture and recreational spaces like golf courses. These lands need to be preserved not just for recreation and not just so people have a nice place to remember what Florida used to be like, but for us to be able to continue to survive in the state, period. Thanks. Just a thought. I hope you guys have a great day.